The following program contains graphic images that may be disturbing. Parents are advised that these images may not be suitable for young children. As doctors, we instinctively and passionately want to heal and help. But sometimes what's conventionally thought to be the best course of action can have extreme outcomes causing more harm than good. I want to warn you, the images you are about to see are hard to look at, and that's because the reality is sometimes medicine hurts. Growing up, I had a really mild case of eczema. When I reached 18, I went to university. I started to become a little bit stressed, so my eczema would become a little bit worse. Went and saw a doctor, and they prescribed me steroid creams. My skin would heal up. However, when I would stop or wean off the steroids, that's when my skin became so much worse. Red, dry, flaky skin covering head to toe. I went to a dermatologist. I was prescribed the oral steroids and I thought the oral steroids were an absolute miracle. However, as soon as I would come off those, my skin would blow up into this horrible rash. My whole body felt like it was on fire. I would sleep with ice packs glued to my skin just to get relief. I was extremely depressed. My life was an absolute living hell. Finally, I found this Instagram post with the hashtag topical steroid withdrawal and no moisture treatment. This involved putting no moisture on the skin at all, no showering. You had to limit your water intake, which sounds very scary. So when the pandemic hit, I felt like this is going to be the best time to go through this. About a month in, my skin was so dry. It was like sandpaper. I developed this extremely oozy patch of skin on the side of my face, constantly itching, couldn't move because my body hurt so much. I was extremely scared because this is gonna take so many years to heal and I don't know how much longer I can go through this. For years, Lucy's skin was so inflamed, but wait until you see what she looks like today. She joins us now from her home in Australia. Hi there, Lucy. Hi, how are you? We're great, and such a pleasure to have you. Looking at you now, I would have no idea where you came from. But when you look in the mirror, even today, what do you see? I look in the mirror now, and I'm, I'm in shock. I can't believe this is how I look now. It's truly amazing. But still, there is that fear in the back of my mind. I do have some small patches of skin you can see here on my arm. I'm in fear that it's going to come back just as bad as it was because with this condition of topical steroid withdrawal, it can come and go in cycles. So that's always a worry of mine. And Lucy, you do look so much better now, but I'm curious when things were severe on a scale of one to 10, how would you rate the pain? It was definitely a 10. It was the worst pain I'd ever felt in my life. It wasn't just that physical pain of burning, inflamed, itchy, cracked, oozy skin. It was also the mental pain as well that really took a toll on me. 